Hey everybody, we are on the Zero to Income website and in particular we are in the Zero to Income toolbox which if you'd like to have access to this toolbox we do have a link down below that you can sign up and get access to the toolbox. Uh, there are a number of really cool features that are included in the toolbox. We have custom code snippets, we have uh, a system.io website template, and then we have a handful of ChatGPT prompts that you can use for your business. Uh, one of the code snippets that we have is for a WhatsApp floating action button. All right, and we've got actually a couple of similar code snippets here. One was just for a just a general floating action button that you could use to uh, as a contact us button. Uh, this one here is so that if you want to click on it and have the website visitor just start uh, chatting with you on WhatsApp, that's what this button's for. So what I want to do in this video is add a new a floating action button, and this one's going to be for Facebook Messenger. Okay, and so this code, you'll go into the uh, toolbox, and there's nothing there as of yet, but there will be. And you'll do a copy code, and right now this code here is for the WhatsApp floating action button, but you would click on the copy code. The code that I have right now it is opened in another tab copy. Now most of our videos on zero to income focus on system.io or brilliant directories and in this case I'm going to show you how to use this code to add this floating action button for Facebook Messenger onto your system.io website. Now this code will work in go high level. It'll work in Kajabi. It'll work in clicks though. Uh, if your website platform has the ability to add custom code, and that could be something like custom code or forward slash uh, custom JavaScript, uh, you'll want to be looking for something like that or CSS. If you have something like that, chances are you can add this code and you can do exactly what I'm doing right here in system.io. So that being said, let's jump on over here into system.io and let me show you how to add this code and and how it works and and how to use it really so we're in our system.io site and we're in the editor for the site now what we're going to do is scroll all the way down and we're going to grab a raw html element doesn't really matter where you pop this um, i'm going to pop it just up towards the top because that's where the floating action button is in this case and then we're just going to click into the code we're going to edit code and then we're going to paste we're going to take out that default code and we'll put paste in the code that you'll be able to get by clicking on that copy code option. So if we save it, you'll see up in the upper right hand corner that button's going to show up. So we're going to click on save and there it is. But we're not done because we got to you've, you've got to actually put your address in here so that when somebody clicks on it and they open up and log into their messenger.com and to start chatting with you they're going to be chatting with you. So how do we change that? All right. So what you'll want to do is you're going to want to get your Facebook profile name. Okay. Edit code. And you'll put it right down here where it says div class equals fab container and then an a href tag. And then here's the link to Facebook Messenger, so that's your standard Facebook Messenger link that everybody's going to have, and then your page ID will go right here. All right. So in my case, it would be uh, my one of my test accounts is my Egbert Peabody account, and that's the username on my Facebook account would be would go right in here, and then paste. Okay, and then save. So now what we're going to do is we're going to click on preview just to kind of take a look at it. And right up here, you have this now floating action button here that people can click on and start chatting with you on Facebook Messenger. How cool is that? So if you're really liking these videos uh, on System.io in particular, we have a whole playlist on System.io. Check that out. If you like this floating action button tool in the description down below, you can sign up and get access to the toolbox. We're always adding to it and it's free. Thanks for watching, everybody.